most of the industries they prefer IIT Hyderabad and IIT Madras. Right. So a lot of South Indian, South or Southern Belt students and even North Indian North also, Indian also. Their preference is becoming IIT Hyderabad. Hyderabad. In the national institutional ranking framework, yes, yes, that is yes. uh, N I R F, it has got eighth rank. It has got eighth rank. Let us say after ten years, they are working in certain industry. This IIT, which is new at the moment, is going to uh, become better and better with time, and it is going to earn that IIT tag. Uh, IIT Hyderabad is such an institute in which you can get an admission. With the gate scorecard and without, without the, the gate scorecard card also. Namaskar, we welcome you all in the fifth episode of our MTech Admission Guidance Program series. I am Amrinder Singh, and with me, your beloved Varun Pathak sir. Namaskar, everyone. So, what we are going to discuss today, sir. On the huge demand of our students, and there are many students who have been writing mails, messages to us. And one important point here, which I would like to make we are going to <coughs> discuss IIT Hyderabad. Now, sir, what is very special about this IIT? Very true, Amrinder sir, because uh, in the last uh, few days, from the start point of this series, na, but I must say, uh, because I remember this, that you should not miss any of the videos in this series, because it is a sequence in which we are moving. If you miss out on any of the video in between, it is not because you will miss the philosophy behind the masters. And in a lot of videos, because you know, all these videos that we are making are not just information, it is about knowledge enhancement, knowledge improvement, enrichment and opening up your mind towards the master's course. Right. Now sir, coming back to your question that what is so special about IIT Hyderabad? Because since the start of this uh, uh, series. series, a lot of students, so many, I think this is one of the most demanded, demanded. videos. Most demanded. My mobile is full. Uh, that sir, please do a video on IIT Hyderabad. Please do a video on IIT Hyderabad. So today is a day that we are going to discuss IIT Hyderabad. But uh, me sir, and Amrinder uh, sir, haan. one thing I would just a disclaimer I want to give to our listeners. Uh, you may be wondering that <laughs> we have done our all, <laughs> all the, the previous the... videos purely in Hindi. So this video is going to be mostly in English. Why is it so? Sir will tell you. See, basically a lot of uh, students from southern part of the country, they are highly interested in one of this topmost institute that is IIT Hyderabad. So just for the sake of that, we are going to keep this video mostly, mostly most of the mostly. part of this video in English. English. Now coming back to the same point, sir, we were discussing before making this video that why there is so much of craze for IIT Hyderabad. Right. Why we are receiving so many messages for IIT Hyderabad. Sir, uh, what we found it out was according to our knowledge is that IIT Hyderabad is a newer IIT. It's a second generation Gen IIT. Right. But the beauty lies in the fact that in the last four to five years, this institute with its research, with its topmost level of placements and uh, complete professional level, you know, uh, and with students also, top level students also preferring this because a lot of the South Indian belt of the students uh, due to the industries, uh, you know, sir, most of the industries, they are in uh, Chennai, Bengaluru, Hyderabad. So this is also Pune. getting the geographical dividend right. out of it, Pune. So this complete industrial belt most of the industries, they prefer IIT Hyderabad and IIT Madras. Right. So a lot of South Indian, South or Southern Belt students and even North Indian North also, Indian also, their preference is becoming IIT Hyderabad. Hyderabad. So though it is a second generation IIT, but in the last four to five years, it has made a name for itself. itself. And sir, uh, in the national institutional ranking framework, yes, yes, that is yes. uh, N. IRF, it has got 
एट्थ रैंक इट हैज गॉट एट्थ रैंक सो दिस इज इनक्रेडिबल सर बींग न्यू आई आई टी एंड दिस थिंग वी हैव ऑलरेडी टॉक अबाउट इन अवर प्रीवियस वीडियोज दैट डोंट गेट अफ्रेड टू ज्वाइन न्यू आर आई आई टी सी आई आई टी हैदराबाद इज डिफरेंट आई कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट बट डोंट बी अफ्रेड टू ज्वाइन न्यू आर आई आई टी बिकॉज यू नो ऑल ऑफ देम आर सेंट्रली फंडेड एवरी ईयर दे आर गोइंग टू गेट फंडेड and if a student is joining a particular institute na they must think about the next 40 years so in their career timeline let us say after 10 years they are working in certain industry this iit which is new at the moment is going to uh, become better and better with time and it is going to earn that iit tag so that tag. tag which you have got the importance of it increases as the uh, iit Uh, gets reputation for itself the tag itself is well recognized but the institute as it gets its own reputation the uh, quality associated with this tag grows sir so, the very important point yes. which we have to discuss specially for it hyderabad it hyderabad because most of the students in their messages <clears throat> they were mentioning about something yes so all of you who are watching this video should watch this very carefully to the end till the end this because. one we are demanding that you should watch till the yeah. end otherwise you will lose out on something very important because let me specify this uh, iit hyderabad is such an institute in which you can get an admission with the gate score card and without, without the, the gate, gate score card, card also and that is the major reason why a lot of students, students. they have been messaging yes. us so in today's video we are going to discuss in detail in brief that how you can get an admission in iit hyderabad even if you haven't qualified the gate, gate exam. examination right so sir let us uh, begin with our discussion yes now uh, see <clears throat> because we were talking about the uh, admission in iit hyderabad apart from the gate exam let us brief you about the various modes of admission in iit hyderabad so there are basically three modes uh, by which you can join into iit hyderabad masters courses so the first one is the normal one sponsored by ministry of education okay in which you uh, should have a valid score card like other iits and you are going to get 12400 rupees as your stipend, stipend. Uh, as your teaching assistantship if, if right. to be said and and, uh, and yes. the uh, the details of the uh, gate cut off score etc regarding this admission we yes. will uh, come we will discuss with in the these things in the later part of the video and uh, so this is the normal one yeah. like other iits like okay. other iits uh, now the second category through which you can go into iit hyderabad is uh, the project based students right but uh, you know all these students are basically industry sponsored industry students. sponsored people like for example you are working in a certain industry certain company and that company is sponsoring you to do the masters in iit hyderabad right now comes the most uh, asked doubt and the most asked question that sir does iit hyderabad allow self sponsored category so the answer to this question is yes, yes. a big yes and this is this is iit hyderabad is special we will be discussing that also but the important thing is 50 50 ratio is almost maintained in all the branches all the branches so for example just for the sake of example for example let us say the batch strength in a certain specialization of iit hyderabad is 30 So out of those thirty students, fifteen students will be through gate category. Fifteen will be through the through self-sponsored the? category, uh, and we can say some yes. of them are also from the industry sponsored. Yes, but a major chunk, a major chunk of the students also prefer self-sponsored category. Category, and we will talk about that self-sponsored category. So first also. thing is that in the self-sponsored category, you <clears throat> don't need to have a valid gate scorecard. even if you haven't qualified gate examination it doesn't matter you can apply into iit hyderabad the branches which we are going to discuss in the self sponsored category but there is a process there is a you, process there right. is a process how you can get into these branches so tell tell them something about the process right so uh, when you have not uh, valid gate score or you have not qualified the gate exam the self sponsored category gives you a chance to join this premier institute 
now the process is you have to undergo a written test sir a written yes. test is conducted they have given uh, the people who are interested in this category listen carefully they have given a model question paper on their website, website. so you can search what type of test is taken uh, and when you give that test, they will call you if yes. you qualify, they will and call you for the uh, interview. Just one more point I want to add here is that uh, we have talked to a lot of students, our current batch students which are present in IIT Hyderabad whose testimonials you can see at the end of the video right. and uh, this thing we you are must saying see with that. you must see the testimonials because we have uh, we have students from almost all the branches of IIT Hyderabad right. and uh, the testimonials are been. So those students they have told us that the level of this written paper in the self-sponsored category mm. is almost similar to the gate examination. Mm. Calculator is allowed and as Amrinder sir said that a sample question paper is already uploaded on the IIT Hyderabad website. Right. Now, in this question paper, there will be two parts, sir. One part is the common part, aptitude, mathematics, reasoning right. and English and things like that. Right. But the second part will be relevant to the branch, branch in which you are applying for. For example, let us say you are applying for uh, uh, machine design or mechanical design. So most of the questions in that second part of the paper, you have to choose for design question, design part. So the second part of the paper is going to be distributed in different, different parts. So whatever specialization you want to apply for, you have to choose that part of the paper to solve. Right. Apart from this, interviews is also there. That interview is, the is also yeah. there. But there is a catch here. The catch is hmm. that in the self-sponsored category, as told by our students in IIT Hyderabad, you will have to give them a significant amount in the <laughs> You have fee. to shell out a <laughs> lot of money to be very frank. 12 lakhs. 12 lakhs. Lakh Overall for overall, the for two years, two years M Tech, this is what so, see, the people sir, have told. What is the fundamental difference between this and this is here you are getting twelve thousand four hundred rupees as stipend. Also, your college fees is also subsidized. Subsidized. But if you are a self-sponsored category student, you know twelve lakh rupees approximately twelve lakh rupees is going to be the fees for your two years course. And apart from that, you are not going to get any stipend. stipend. So complete 12 lakh, you have to pay from pay your own, own pocket. pocket. But right. wait, sir. One more point uh, I want to have a discussion here is just to have a wider frame. See, students, all our videos, we have always made it a point. These are not information. These are knowledge. So Well-researched. We, Well-researched knowledge. And you are going to... Uh, see this in our vocabulary, in our thought process that how the teachers are moving forward, they will understand that these are not normal YouTube videos. Sir, one point of discussion is that if a student is spending 12 lakh rupees to get an admission into IIT Hyderabad, but still the number of applications because the students told us hmm. that the number of applications coming to IIT Hyderabad for this self-sponsored category thing is huge. Huge. Large number of applications. And are they coming. are also, sir, IIT Hyderabad every subsequent year is also they increasing, are increasing the seats, seats. Number of See, seats. See, second generation IIT but now becoming popular and popular day by day. Uh, it has become so much of popular because we have already talked to IIT Madras students right. also, IIT Hyderabad students. It is getting in comparison competition. to competition with IIT Madras. And uh, uh, let me tell this thing, IIT Madras and Hyderabad, both of them are doing excellent, 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 excellent. in terms of research, in terms of placements, in terms of, uh, you know, startups or anything that you can say. Because, sir, uh, one reason behind this is the South Indian mindset. Yes. I have... Yes, uh, see, we should talk about it. We, we should, should talk, talk about, about it. it. Uh, the the thing here is that I have seen in uh, our South Indian students, there is a tendency, an orientation towards learning. Yes. Uh, many of the students who come to uh, us for uh, the coaching, gate coaching, many of them are not very resistant. In fact, very aligned. Even, to even, doing uh, masters. even before doing the coaching in their head, they are very specific right. that why they are writing the gate paper. gate paper. So if you are going to ask a lot of South Indian students uh, that what do you, what is your uh, aim after gate examination? They are very clear. They are so much inclined towards master's, master's. degree. 
doing. Right. But if you talk about the North Indian students, they are more over inclined towards the PSUs. Getting even job. Af even after mm. getting into the IITs, in their head somewhere it uh, is stuck. Stuck. That uh, PSUs are the only thing. The government jobs are only thing. Right. So that mindset has to change. Has yes. to change. It has to be a balance. Balance. See, nothing it depends, is right. Nothing uh, is wrong. It depends on your preferences. But the only thing is that you should not drag the hangover of the government job so long that you spend so many years wasting your time even in the premier institutes. Okay. Sir, let us answer that question that if a student is spending 12 lakh rupees right. and uh, so many applications are still coming, so there will be something special about IIT Hyderabad. Because if someone is spending 12 lakh of rupees, he, uh, no one is, uh, you, you can say, sir, uh, that surplus every, money. Yes, yes, this much surplus money for master's degree and also everyone also thinks maturely about the return on investment. ROI. ROI. Uh. As also students, you can see in the testimonial, a lot of mature students are there. So, they have talked about this point, ROI. But the beauty about IIT Hyderabad is the placements. The placements are so super. In master's course, the placements are so superb. Even you can check our testimonials also. All almost, I think, uh, one of the student was in first year. Right. Rest of the other was in second year. Ah. So they were placed. They were placed. So super duper placements are there. That this much amount that you are spending on your master's for you two will, years now, you will recover in you one year. You will recover itself in one year. One year. That is the reason why, because a student who is spending twelve lakh rupees. If he is getting a sure shot guarantee of placement, right. then only the uh, student moves forward and takes up the course. Now, that, Sir, yes. uh, one more thing which I would like to mention here, whether you come through gate ah, or through self-sponsored category, once you enter in IIT Hyderabad in your batch, all are equal, all no are treated same. No discrimination. Now, based on your performance in that coursework, you are eligible for various companies and uh, the sky is the limit. It all depends on your hard work and dedication. Very important point Amrinder sir. I again want to highlight this point because a lot of you after uh, looking at MOE and self-sponsored, they might be in a dilemma that uh, after joining through self-sponsored category, there would have been some kind of a discrimination in academics as well as at placement level. Oh. So, we have talked to so many students. Hmm. Once you enter into the institute, no matter whether you are entering through gate scorecard or whether you are entering through self-sponsored, but once you are a student of a particular batch, then there is no discrimination in academics, in research as well as in placements. Right. Chali, let us now discuss, sir, that how many... Okay, so <coughs> let us discuss the first department. So, the mechanical and aerospace department, it has four, four courses under it. So, let us discuss one by one the courses yes, involved. Yes. So, we have the mechanics and design. It is called as MAD, MAD. The this sir, uh, uh, this very important we should, point, sir. we should give this Please disclaimer. Uh, on the IIT Hyderabad side, see, whatever data we share with you, we make it very, very important that the data is very authentic because a lot of you will depend on that data for your decision making. So, this uh, we have taken from the IIT Hyderabad website. The data for 2020 was available and that was, sir, yes. uh, in a reply to an RTI that was RTI, filed. it was there. Uh, recent data was not available on the IIT Hyderabad website. Right. So, but, sir, from yes. our experience, we can give them a slight, slight idea. Range, some idea we are yeah. going to give that if your score, gate score, see, if you are from self-sponsored, there is no issue. No issue. But if you want it through gate, Okay, because the placements are very high, things are, and this IIT Hyderabad is coming in a, a tough, tough competition, competition with all the top IITs. Right, right. So, that is the reason why you can see that even if this is gate 2020 cutoff, but you can see me mechanics and machine design, the cutoff is quite high, 769. But yes. one statement Amrinder sir said in between, 2020 was another year, now it is 2024 the number of seats every year has increased. Have increased. Even though this college has uh, become popular, raised its ranking, but because of the increasing number of seats and reducing number of 
applicants from the mechanical sir mm -hmm. i think this can also be one of the reason yes. that uh, when we have talked to the students see no official data is with us but through our experience of interacting with the student we have seen that slightly slightly there is a reduction we have seen in the cut off sir gate cut off scores so approximately sir let us give them an idea that if your gate score is above this uh, it is your your judicious yes, decision yes. that you can apply to iit hyderabad sir i think we can uh, because see iit bombay around. has uh, given that they uh, will allow above 600 gate score yes so even though it will be your choice because you have to fill the form uh, pay the amount but i think sir we can take some range around 6 650 about yes, 650 plus if you want to apply in mechanics department this is for general general category we are uh, talking about if you have a gate score above 650 then definitely you can try in iit hyderabad right okay and by a standard rule we can uh, just take around 90-95% of this for the OBC yes. and so on for the percent yeah. for uh, uh, schedule caste and schedule tribe and so on. Right. Achha, sir, now let us talk about the branch. What is the coursework related to this work? So before starting this, let me just give credits to our student Gotham and, and Rudramani. Rudramani. They have supported so, so fabulously yes. to us uh, uh, because they are already doing uh, their masters in uh, uh, design in IIT Hyderabad. Right. You will find their testimonials. So go watch. Uh, no, first first watch us. Then at the end of the, end video, of the video, you continue watch watching the video. Yeah. You will find it. So, uh, sir, around what we were told that 35 to 40 students yes, we are this expecting year, this, this year, year. This year we are expecting this year. Intake. So the total batch strength of this mechanics and design is going to be approximately 30, uh, 35 to 40 students are going to be there. Out now, of as which, I told, yes, yeah. very good. <coughs> 10 sir, to 15 will be through yes. gate. So, 10 to 15 will be through taken through gate category that is MOE and 7 MOE to 8 and 7 to 8 approximately self-sponsored. Self-sponsored, self-sponsored or uh, maybe more than that. But this is, condition. see, this is the expected for this year. And this is the general idea which we are giving you, yes. right? Yes, sir. Okay. So now, no. sir, let us talk about the course content here. Yes. So, course content, if you see, if you want to relate it with your BTEC subjects or the gate preparation subjects, SOM, TOM, mechanics. Sir, any uh, further projection yes. for that? See, the vibration becomes a very important course because we have uh, also talked to other IIT students in yes. design. Yes. So, vibration is one critical part, vibrational analysis, basic advanced mechanics, mechanics uh, you know, finite element analysis, both basic and advanced level, vehicle dynamics, this also a lot of IIT students have told us, yes. it is part of their curriculum, curriculum. also, vehicle dynamics, uh, composites. vibration, dy composites and again, machine from, learning from second semester itself a lot of softwares yeah you cannot run away from softwares have the learning mentality machine learning abacus ansys so abacus and ansys are basically the tools or the softwares for finite, finite element, element analysis, analysis. And for dynamic mm. and multi-body analysis, we have Adam Adam's software, software that you have to learn. Otherwise, apart from that, MATLAB, MATLAB Python that yeah. we have been constantly talking about in design yes. branch. Sir, machine learning here is comes in the elective course, but uh, I think all of the students have recommended yeah. it recommended. that for increasing your prospects of placement, you should go with it, right? Sir, let us now talk about the placement. placement. Sir, sir, I think we should write 100%. Incredible placement. <laughs> And this is not almost uh, 100%, this is exactly 100%. 100%. Okay, you name the company, the company is there. This year, current batch, maximum package has 22 gone to 22 LPA. Lakhs. Average package is 15 LPA. 14 to 15 LPA, yeah. Bajaj, MRF, MRF Tata, Tata Motors, Motor, Volvo Aisher, Volvo, Whirlpool, Mahindra. Sir, there is Gotham, one. Gotham, yeah. the student which is there. Yeah. Uh, you will see in the testimonial, he is placed in Tata Motor. So, yeah. we have a conversation with right. him. And one important thing is, we would like to mention here that, ah. sir, the, the, roles. the roles which the companies offer when the people join through masters. The role will be offered as deputy managers or, sir, uh, it is senior, it also, managers, yeah, senior managers, senior profiles yeah, or senior maybe profiles. in R&D. Yeah. So, this thing we have been constantly discussing with them. 
uh, in the previous IIT Bombay, yes. IIT Delhi videos, we have already discussed these things exactly. that uh, you know senior profiles are given after the masters. Hmm. Compared e to B.Tech. If it is B.Tech, generally a lot of companies they take G.E.T. Graduate Engineering training. training. But after masters, it is P.G.T. Post Graduate Engineering Engineer training. training. So the role itself is a lot of stability. Yes. So let, let us, us move on to the to next branch, yeah. sir. It is thermofluids. Thermofluid engineering. Uh, again, sir, regarding the cutoff, this is gate 2020. 2020. As Please we remember this that these cutoffs that we are showing on the board is just for the reference, reference purpose. purpose. But you guys can see one important thing that these cutoffs of IIT Hyderabad are, are actually in line mm -hmm. with the cutoffs of. IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi. Delhi. So right. you cannot ah. say that it is second generation or it is a newer IIT. Students are preferring this IIT. Right. So if we compare the uh, cutoff here with the uh, design cutoff here, if you yes. see, uh, this is 769, and we can see it is slightly lower. So this is uh, slightly lower than that. That slightly lower. Slightly lower. Slightly lower than that. And if we see the current scenario. I think, sir, the people 650 with plus, uh, 650 that, plus that is the should apply. Uh, 650 plus uh, gate score people in general category hmm. must apply. Sir, uh, one fluids, more yeah. advice I would like to give because uh, the student have told that the seats are continuously increasing. Maybe I think, in my opinion, uh, candidate with more than let us say 625, 630, 640 See, score also consider. Why me and Amrinder sir are discussing so much on this is. Our see from our heart, we want that the opportunity should not get missed. Yes. Even if there is a small scope, na, yeah. then the student should apply. That is the only thing which is in their in our heart. That's why we are rigorously trying to give you an idea. But it is just about a small amount of money, beta. Hmm. Because if you are filling the form of IIT Hyderabad, let us say uh, we haven't seen what is the application amount. So uh, maybe 300, 400, 500 or it is a mediocre amount, beta. It doesn't matter. But the opportunity should not get missed. Okay. Right. So, sir, again. Placement is 100%, sir. Placement is 100%. That is the no first doubt thing about we should that. write. <laughs> so, 100% is yeah. the placement. And then uh, the companies, if we see Whirlpool and computed aided engineering uh, that profiles are offered almost same placement as design you can say yes. 90 percent companies they will allow all allow the mechanical all. see uh, uh, according to the students of iit hyderabad this complete department mad this. so there are four branches sir this year mechanical yeah, and mechanical aerospace. and aerospace this is one of the department no 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 Ah, okay, mechanical <coughs> and aerospace. Ah, this is one of the one departments. Of the department. Yes. Yeah. Uh, thanks, Amrinder sir, for uh, clarifying this. Uh, the thing is that mechanical and aerospace department. This is a complete department which has four specializations. So, if a company comes uh, for, for recruitment, na, all the students of the mechanical and aerospace engineering department, they are allowed. They are allowed. Certain. Yeah. Okay, sir. Let us move on to the next one. Ah, IDM. IDM. In short, they call this IDM, IDM, Integrated Design and Manufacturing. manufacturing. Sir, they have, uh, if we talk about the batch strength, they have uh, around, uh, let us say, 8 total strength. Out of that, 7 through gate, 8 is the total strength, total. And out of that, we have 7 through gate, 7 through gate. And see, this is not hard and fast. Ah, this is right not hard and fast. The, the, uh, this because is it dynamic. is up to the IIT to decide yes. that this year how many seats they are going to have in a particular specialization. Right. So, th this is just for the sake of your idea. Sake of your idea, right. And sir, if we talk about the cutoffs, it is, it is very in line with the in thermal. Line, in line because with the thermal. Bacha, what is happening is the placement is 100 percent. Yes. Na? And the companies are allowing. Companies are allowing. So, everyone is sitting. So, therefore, whenever the chances of placements are uh, there, uh, definitely the cutoffs, you can see it in the form of cutoffs. So, again, 600. <laughs> Sir, this is uh, 2020 data, just 
let me yes. keep reminding them. So, if you are having again a gate score of 625 plus, 650 plus, definitely you should apply. apply. Right. Uh, sir, let us talk about some of the uh, courses, courses that they have to study. <clears throat> so, we have advanced manufacturing, additive manufacturing, CAD software, finite element analysis as we have already told, Abacus, ANSYS. So, all these things you can relate with this branch. You can see your interest, where your interest lies. See, placement is good everywhere. But one thing I would like to yes. uh, add Again here, specified. sir, that see, you should also see what is your strong part, what is your interest. Because once you go in a certain institution, it is your hard work, your passion that will fetch you a, a good package that so will open up the opportunity. Basically, what happens is uh, a, a person is motivated to do hard work. Na? if his interest, his happiness and his satisfaction, right. all these three things combine together at a single location, then automatically the person is motivated towards doing that thing. Exactly. So, our this video series is so special and every engineering student must see these videos. You must share with all the engineering community students why these videos are special is because we are not just saying just take admission just on the basis of placement. We are trying to align your mind that you should identify first of all that what is your interest, where you are finding happiness, what to, uh, it happens na sir. Yes. For example, when I in mechanical engineering, when I used to study thermal section hmm. rather than design right, section, right, right. automatically I, I got happy. It exactly, happens. Exactly. So, every person has a different scope of interest. Yes. So, you should identify that and then you should cho choose your master's degree. Yes. Otherwise, it will become a huge blunder, yaar. it yes. will become a huge load on you. Uh, okay, one more <coughs> department in the mechanical and aerospace category, so aerospace engineering. Yes, so in aerospace engineering, sir, we have, uh, let us say 15 to 16 are expected yes. candidates, total number of candidates, this is total and out of that, we can say 50 percent are through gate. Rest 50 percent filled with self sponsored plus, plus the industry uh, sponsored. Industry sponsored right? See, aerospace engineering we have already discussed in ISC Bangalore. If you have in, not seen that video, just go, go and, and watch, watch that, that video. video. Uh, we have already discussed in IIT Bombay, right? There is a complete department is there, yes. But IIT Bombay students told us that uh, the placement this year is going a bit lower, lower, but the same thing is not happening with IIT, IIT Hyderabad. Because, uh, sir, there is a reason behind it. Yes. Because this Hyderabad, Bengaluru, Chennai, Chennai, all these locations, a lot of startups, a lot of aerospace industry Industries. is set up around this, yes. uh, these locations. Right. Even if you very important, see, sir. very important. Because you see, uh, General Electrics, you see, uh, they are having their head office in uh, Bangalore. So, in the same manner, Pratt and Whitney, you will find one student. Sir, they might be asking what is Pratt and Whitney. Now, see a mechanical engineer not knowing Pratt and Whitney is wrong. <laughs> uh, see, Pratt and Whitney is actually one of the pioneers in in the aeroplane uh, engine manufacturing. Uh, aero, aeroplane aircraft engine manufacturing. So, one is Rolls pioneer. Royce, one is Pratt and Whitney. Yeah. And one of our students is placed in Pratt, Pratt and, and Whitney. Whitney. You will find the testimonial at the end of the video. Yes. So, uh, sir, and sir uh, this I, I would like to reaffirm the uh, point which you mentioned mm. about the geographical dividend. dividend yes. Because of the geography of this institution, obviously there is a lot of hard work and dedication of the professors as well as the students, but it is going really well. Really well, yes. So, the placement here is again 100 percent, almost, almost 100 percent right. <coughs> and lot of big companies like Honeywell, GK and Aerospace, Pratt and Whitney I told you, General Electrics. Uh, now, the drone manufacturing companies yes. are also coming because this is an upcoming sector upcoming for sector. sure there is no doubt. Sir, in that. one uh, uh, more thing here, the IIT Bombay uh, students they mentioned about the uh, slack in the placement and it is not that there is no placement, it is that ah. suppose a student has already done a job of 15 or 20 LPA and the student joins IIT Bombay, if a company is offering 8 to 10 LPA, the people generally do not take, they think that we will see off campus because the uh, tag value is significantly high. But 
if you see the students of IIT Hyderabad also told us that packages the in initial aerospace, packages yeah. offered in aerospace, this is the current scenario now, it is not going to stay forever, is slightly lesser. But the student have also told us sir, that if you have a foresighted vision, hmm. if you have a foresighted, foresighted vision, vision, then I think you can definitely go if this is your area of interest. Definitely. Uh, because Airbus has also come, uh, yes. I think he told uh, 6 to 7 lakh LPA. So, this 6 to 7, 8 lakh LPA might appear to be a smaller amount mm -hmm. at the start of your career. But once you work 2-3 years in this industry, na, sky is the limit. Yes. Because nobody can match your expertise. Yes. That is and sir, important. if you are in a very good organization, na, yes. the amount of growth, because very ah. good companies sometimes they will not offer very high package. At the but start they end, will yeah. give you very rigorous once, training. Once you get, ex yes, that is also Very rigorous another, training. See, uh, wow, wonderful points are coming, I must say. See, if a company after masters is giving a less package, the uh, reason can also be this that they are giving less, less packages because they are spending more on your training. Training, yes. So, that training amount that you are going to get in that in uh, those industries, th th that coursework and training exactly. itself is having a huge cost burden on the company itself. It is adding value to you. To you. To your so, expertise. Yes, sir. So, I so, think we have yeah. talked a lot. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but uh, wonderful, wonderful expertise is coming from our side also. Yes. You can feel that. Sir, we have actually talked with so many students of different IITs that it is bound to come. Yes. Sir, please. Sir, next. Uh, yes, this branch, Additive Manufacturing. It is an interdisciplinary course. Interdisciplinary course. If we talk about the first thing which we are discussing here, cutoff 691. Again, this is gate 2020 cutoff just for your reference because this is the data available on the IIT Hyderabad website. In, in this branch, uh, the total batch size which is expected is 15 to 16 Sir. students. Yeah. yeah. So, 15 to 16 students batch size is expected for this year. But a lot of you might think, sir, who takes additive manufacturing? I don't know additive manufacturing, this, that, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. You might think like that. <laughs> Let me tell you this thing, IIT Hyderabad is one of the first institutes to introduce this very special branch which is additive manufacturing and in the industry there is a huge demand right. for additive manufacturing engineers right. who have studied these courses like product like design, design prototype, additive fundamentals, metal additive manufacturing, 3D printing, you, you might have heard na? 3D printing, how much big it is coming nowadays. Yes. So, slicing software, finite element analysis, CAD, CAM, all this stuff is there in this branch and uh, this is one of the, uh, you can say, the most demanded course at the moment from the industry point of view. Yes. That is also reflected in the placements. Yes, the placement is very good and uh, highest package which we have been told is 15, 15 LPA. LPA which is given to current batch students in a company with the name Vabtech. 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 So, the you know the average package is around 9 to 10 lakhs. Yes. So, Sir, again 100 percent placement. Yes and this is when we have an year of recession. Huh. You should understand that we have an year of recession where the uh, the overall economy uh, that might be having some struggle, especially the uh, uh, economy, big economies outside India. But in this scenario, this is very very significant. Very good, well, sir. Sir, one more testimonial I m must highlight. One of our students is placed from IIT Hyderabad in Kia Motors at a package of uh, eight and a half to nine lakh something you will find in the testimonials that is the reason why i am telling yeah, again, and again, again and again go and watch the testimonial after the video sir let us move on to the next branch smart, smart mobility. mobility oh ho. great smart mobility sir before recording this video you were telling me something about that how mobility is changing yes so First of all, you should know that smart mobility is a course which is under the CS department. Now, try to understand one thing, mobility, movement, transportation, this is changing in a very, very big way. Now, the era in which we are moving, 
the expertise of all the segments are segments required are it will be integrated to produce the marvelous uh, automotives electrical mechanical cs electronics all the expertise is required, is required. required. civil engineers because sir this branch basically majorly deals with drone technology yes and uh, unmanned aerial vehicles yes so you see if you will see the defense sector of the country uh, you know drones and unmanned aerial vehicles they are so much of in requirement they are so much of in demand yes uh, even in combat warfare combat, yeah, also warfare warfare also drdo is developing things like that so these kind of branches they take up the beauty of that in fact the future wars are expected to be won through unmanned vehicles acha one uh, you can see sir uh, from the cut off very high. i think the mechanical topper this year would have taken this branch uh, see okay. you know a lot of you might think who is or who is taking these branches sir we have heard about only thermal we have only heard about machine design we have only heard about manufacturing see the there are some smart people <laughs> 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 they are some smart people who are taking. foresighted who are future visionaries they are top rankers and they are taking smart smart, smart people taking smart, smart branches, mobility <laughs> like smart mobility so that is great hmm. again the placements are good almost 100% 90 80 to 90% placement yeah. is still there uh, why we are saying 80 to 90% because still the placements are going on yes so uh, you know almost 100% placement sir are one there. more thing here yeah. uh, one of the student told us that uh, the Uh, if a self sponsored candidate wants to enter here uh, they also have in the uh, past they have <coughs> set a criteria because of the demand they have set a criteria it is not necessary that it will be this year but they set a criteria of cgpa in your graduation to be greater than 9 9 yes yes sir one more course integrated sensors and systems this is also Again, sir, an interdisciplinary yeah. course mechanical is allowed maybe 2 to 3 students of mechanical two to three will students. be going into this department rest Sir, will be what is what this uh, this uh, course deals with mainly semiconductor semiconductor packaging packaging is, yeah. fabrication <coughs> the technology associated to that which is again an upcoming, upcoming sector. sector upcoming sector but the only problem is that uh, the mechanical background students they might face they will face might nahi <laughs> they will they will face a lot of challenge in this branch because this is more over related to electronics and electrical right because you have to study sensor systems control systems yes. and things like that vlsi technology but if you are up for the challenge then definitely the placements are great in this particular uh, department and uh, upcoming sector it is yes so you will be doing internship in global foundries if you go in this branch uh, a student got placed in western digital sir more 20, than 20, 20 lakh L lpa package per annum and, and micron also visited <laughs> micron <laughs> also visited this intel of our hearing again and again yes two guys in intel uh, they have the students have told 26 lpa significant package it is qualcom also comes for this so the uh, you know intel is there qualcom is there so their expertise is required in chip manufacturing everywhere and you know chips are part part of almost everything nowadays yes. so uh, aapka knowledge is not going to go into vain any day coming soon sir there is one more branch is also there that yes. is uh, material science and, and metallurgical. metallurgical but unfortunately we have heard In that. this, in this, XC is also allowed. XC is allowed, but uh, the placements are not that good. Hmm. So the placements are not very good. Not very good. See, if you are in a good institution, obviously you can excel, you can take electives, you can work hard, and you can get placed. But compared to other branches, the placement is not that good. So, sir, I think we have discussed uh, all about IIT hmm. Hyderabad. Whatever branches are allowing mechanical engineers, right. uh, even. after so much of discussions don't miss out on the testimonials that you are going to find at the end of this video they will follow just uh, the testimonials are going to follow and dear students we are trying our level best to give you the best of the knowledge we are trying to give you a hand holding support in the times of your panic 
because this two three months of time after the gate result up to uh, the time where you take a certain decision that yes i am going to do an mtech somewhere your teachers are putting in a lot of efforts but still if any kind of guidance any kind of doubts you have certain in mind you can message us directly on telegram i am going to give and sir is also going to give his telegram id uh, on telegram you can just uh, tag at the rate varun pathak sir so the message is going to reach me uh, because we want that every student should get the complete guidance hand holding support right so my telegram id is at the rate a capital amrinder singh made easy amrinder singh made easy now try to understand sir uh, there are some of the students or in fact uh, many people who are doing their bachelors who are watching random videos random videos yeah. my advice to you is you should subscribe to the made easy channel so that whenever a video is uploaded you can get a notification and you can see these series in a systematic manner right and there are many other useful information videos also which i think will make you grow overall as an engineer and uh, uh, sir now i think we have done yes. most of our discussion about the iit hyderabad it takes a lot of effort to give you very authentic information behind which we can stand over time so if that much effort we are doing i think you can show her some love in the comment section below that what value addition or are we helping you to uh, how we helped how this video helped you in making your decision given you clarity just show us and tell us and uh, write to us in the comment section below okay so sir should we uh, keep it a suspense that what will be the next video which college we are sir i think uh, we should keep sir we should keep sir we okay keep so okay suspense. so if amrinder sir is saying <laughs> we are going to keep it a secret that what will be the next college that we are going to cover in we this we are day. planning something very special sir sir but let let them give a hint ha huh. again we are going to get a college which is most demanded by a lot of students and again that college is going to be without the gate score yes that yes. is very important this is your hint for today now you keep on guessing <laughs> which college it is so this is me and amrinder sir signing off for today jai hind namaskar namaskar okay so now let us talk to rudramuni so rudramuni uh, first of all tell us uh, which branch uh, you are in in iit hyderabad i am in mechanics and design branch i am a second year student okay i think i'm not in june in all in june will be passing out from here okay 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 great so are you placed somewhere rudramuni yes yeah, sir in uh, mrf company mrf oh great yeah. great, great sir mrf uh, is a stock market listed company and uh, they haven't done any stock split <laughs> so the share price i think is 130 you would be knowing you will because <laughs> maybe after joining he might get some shares of it uh, <laughs> <laughs> so he he is smiling he will get i know you <laughs> okay so rudramuni which batch of uh, medici you have done uh, sir in uh, 2019 2019 yeah hyderabad batch if yeah. i am not wrong okay so I, any I, any I, Uh, I want to share experience of Medici with, uh, ah. with your permission. Ah. But uh, the faculty in Medici, you Varun Pratap sir, Amrinder sir, Bansal sir, yeah sir, what you have taught in uh, fluid mechanics or strength of material till now, we remember the concept, the formulas, everything. That is uh, one of the advantage that we get from Medici. That is that is great. Any memory of from IIT Hyderabad or anything that you want to share with the. upcoming aspirants who aspire to be in iit hyderabad sir uh, iit hyderabad big, uh, it is a second generation iit no doubt but when it comes about teaching faculty uh, placement it is one of the best in when compared to many old generation iit okay okay that is a fabulous point put together rudramuni 
right okay now we will talk with uh, gautam gautam so gautam which branch uh, you are from in iit hyderabad uh, so i am in second year currently so i will be i am specializing in mechanics and design and will be graduating by july july or june this year so yeah. okay so uh, one thing i would like to mention that gautam has given us a, a party in uh, hyderabad <laughs> we still remember that we party still remember Uh, which which restaurant was it? Uh, it was a famous restaurant. I have huh. forgotten the, the name. Subaya Mess, if I am not wrong. Yes. Eh? Since since you you both were veg, so we were bound to go to veg <laughs> restaurant. So that is Subaya Gari Hotel. And we, I think so, uh, Sir birthday was there also. So we had a. Ah uh, yes, it yes. it was my birthday. Yes yes. Okay. So we I had uh, surprise there. Hmm. So this is the kind of relationship that we share with our old students old also. Students, yeah. So many years back, but still the memory is so fresh. Right. So Gautam, uh, yeah. coming to your branch, uh, yeah. how are the placements in design? So, so our batch yeah. placements are very good. Uh, so it's it's all it's hundred percent placements. So our seniors also is hundred percent placement. So no doubt. So M A D is always better placements if you ask. one of the top branch if we want to prefer it hyderabad right yes yes i would say if if someone is uh, taking a it hyderabad so i would suggest them to take mad as first preference okay okay, okay. yes Great. so you also we assume must have been placed by now right yes i got placed uh, i so got placed in tata motors tata motors tata, tata, motor. tata, tata, tata motors very nice yes. very nice Yeah. What's the package if you are comfortable with it? Uh, no, sir, I can't disclose okay, okay. that. No but issues, no issues. it's it's really a good package. Okay. Really package. Yeah. Th- this Your will do. This will do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, great, wonderful. So now we will talk to Prakash. Uh, yes, sir. Prakash, which uh, branch you are from? Uh, sir, I basically I'm a second year M student. I'm doing uh, my M Tech in Aerospace Engineering. Uh, and uh, now it is in July. Till July, I'll get the password. Okay. Okay. So regarding the aerospace engineering specifically, because this branch is there in the uh, IC Bangalore also, uh, IIT Bombay, IIT Bombay, also. IIT Kanpur also. Anything specific hmm. about this branch which you mention, uh, which you want to mention regarding the placements and coursework in IIT Hyderabad? Uh, sir, uh, I'll mention one thing that in IIT Hyderabad we have well established the research uh, sector for the structural engineering. that is the part of aerospace engineering and the cfd engineering that is the one thing uh, when it's come to the experimental when it come to the numerical all the things and second thing the course work that rigorous course work continuous course work that's the build student for the industry research that's the one thing i can say about the aerospace engineering if a person wants to take admission in aerospace in uh, let us say iit hyderabad so uh, the persons who are uh, the people who are interested in research or further studies should take this admission or uh, we can look this branch uh, for the placements also uh, firstly most student coming here for are uh, like uh, for the research only but uh, if you c- come to the placement uh, aerospace in the, uh, like our batch has almost 100% placement so we can look out also that part also that yeah placement is also good. so prakash where are you placed Uh, sir, I got the placement in Pratt and Whitney. That is the one of the biggest giant in uh, yes. uh, engine manufacturing and R&D. Engine manufacturing. So, uh, Great. Is that is yeah. awesome. So, so let us uh, come to Jagdish. Yes, sir. Hello, Jagdish. How are you? Hello, sir. Hello, sir. I'm good. How are you? <laughs> so, what is your branch, Jagdish, in IIT Hyderabad? Sir, uh, I am an uh, M Tech second year student in Additive Manufacturing. I will be passed oh. out in uh, month of June. Okay, okay, that is great. So this, uh, when you hear this word Additive Manufacturing, so mm. what is the coursework in edi- Additive Manufacturing? A few uh, things about the coursework. So coming to coursework, uh, we will have uh, uh, particularly fundamentals of Additive Manufacturing, and uh, the main focus in Additive Manufacturing in IIT Hyderabad especially is in uh, Metal Additive Manufacturing. Okay. So 
uh, apart from this, uh, if a student want to join additive manufacturing, he should be comfortable uh, with the uh, thermo fluid uh, uh, dynamics and also uh, he should be comfortable with the material science. Okay. Right. So, are you placed somewhere, Jagdish? Because yes, you are also uh, in second year. <clears throat> yeah, I, I, I got placed in Kia Motors. Kia, Kia Motors. Motors, that is great. great. And awesome. what about the general placements in this branch? Uh, general placement this year for my batch it is around 95 percent. Ah, almost all good place. Almost all good place. Yes. And still the placement season is going it's on. Still placement so is the remaining going. might get placed in the coming yes. days. Obviously. Okay. So now let us talk to Aditya. Aditya yes, is uh, yes, actually sir. junior to Jagdish. Yeah. <laughs> in uh, the same branch, additive manufacturing. Aditya, so, tell us something about uh, your experience here. See, I've got a play, uh, got admission in uh, past July only. I have okay. completed my one semester there and I am currently in second semester. The first semester courses were basic of fundamental subjects, which are related okay. to pure additive manufacturing. And in second year, we have given some baskets in which we have we can take machine learning and uh, hmm. computational fluid dynamics and all related to other branches subjects also. Means if, if someone has skill interest in uh, computer science and other so he can go to that way also after taking additive manufacturing and its base branch he can take the placements of cs and other other companies other branches also he is eligible for that okay if he has knowledge related to that right so uh, the overall scenario which you see here because you have now spent some time so yes. to the students who uh, will be coming to iit hyderabad uh, yeah, yeah. for admission this year anything spe any specific advice which you want to give so no, there is not uh, such a specific advice just uh, <laughs> it's a good opportunity which iit hyderabad iit hyderabad is giving us for uh, uh, for offering these courses like additive manufacturing idm climate change smart mobility these are some means uh, apart from mechanical based branch these are some other branches which give us specialized uh, specialization and one thing about IIT Hyderabad, additive manufacturing is only one branch which IIT Hyderabad is of, I means on, uh, only IIT Hyderabad only is of, IIT IIT not other IIT is offering this branch mm -hmm. all over the India. Okay, that is that is great. That is wonderful. Yes, sir. So Aditya, you have been a Medizi student. Yes, sir. Branch, I was the batch of twenty three. In twenty three, I was at Sultanpur, sir, Delhi. Oh, Sultanpur, so, Delhi itself. Okay, yes, that is awesome. So it yes, was sir. pleasure talking to you all, and uh, Thank you, sir. God Thank bless you, sir. you all. You you really don't know that how much you are uh, being a part of this. How much you are be benefiting the upcoming student community and the student generation. Okay, because this video is going to reach to lakhs of student, and I'm not joking about it. Because our first two videos, they have got so much of love of IIC Bangalore, IIT IIT. Bombay, IIT Delhi, and now it will be IIT Hyderabad. So it is reaching to lakhs of students and beautiful comments are coming on those videos. So uh, thanks for being a part of it. God bless you all. Stay in touch. And uh, it was pleasure talking to you all. Thank you Thank so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I wish everyone good luck. Okay. <laughs>